So I got a couple supporters that keep asking me, like, how is it for the Samoans and for the Asians in jail, uh, Indians, things like that. So I'm going to just keep it brief. Um, they're, like, pretty low in numbers, bro. And the reason for that, I feel, and they all run together for the most part, like Asians, Samoans, like in, in uh, California penitentiaries, like they run together from what I've observed, you know, they run together and even some like Indians run together, but some of them don't. They run like they try to run by themselves and shit. That's another story. But um, when they run others, bro, uh, they're kind of small in numbers because a lot of like Asians, Samoans, like, even other ethnic groups, even Rasa, bro, you know, they run, like, in black neighborhoods, like Bloods and Cribs, things like that. So they end up running with the blacks in a prison system, you know. So that's just real brief, you know, from what I see. You know, they when they run others, you know, I don't really see they have a hard time. But when shit does pop off, like, with another ethnicity or something, it's pretty bad for them, you know, keep it G, because they're hella outnumbered, you feel me? Like, even people of their own ethnicity run against them sometimes, you know, like, but, um, blacks usually run with others, so it's pretty, like, cool for, for the ones that did run with them, you feel me, but, yeah, that's just to answer a couple questions that I've, that I've got, you know, I hope that helped, K-Live Black and Brown, y'all know what it is.